Hey, hello everybody. Welcome to Greg's Beer Reviews today. Hey, let's go see what's in the fridge today. Alright guys, thanks for stopping by Greg's Beer Review today. Today's beer is Tommy Knocker Maple Nut Brown Ale. This comes from Tommy Knocker, a brewery out of Colorado. It is an American brown ale. They use Munich caramel and chocolate malts to make this beer. And uh, uh, from what I read in here, they use a lot of maple syrup too in this beer. So. Should be pretty sweet beer, I would think. We're about to find out. Uh, this is year-round serving for them, so if you can get their, uh, their beers in your area, you ought to be able to get this one. Uh, it's got the date code on the back of on the label here, so a thumbs up for me on that. Uh, the food pairings cuisine says barbecue, cheese of the earthy, camel birds, bontina and nutty, asago, colby, parmesan, and the meat is beef. Pint glass, Becker, Stein, mug, just poured into something. Uh, ABV 4.50, so pretty low ABV on this, and you should be able to session this. A nice looking cap on here. I have to say that one. So, uh, not recommended for scented salaries, so if you get it, drink it. So let's pour it in there and see what we get. a fairly clear beer. Uh, it's very dark, uh, almost a copper bronze, dark, deeper amber color. Uh, it's got a, it's got a, uh, it's got a, a heavy copper color to it, I would think. So, uh, didn't pour very much head, about a half a finger of head, and it's dissipated quickly. A lot of bubbles streaming up on, from the bottom of the glass on this one, guys, so. Mm, I can smell the maple syrup in that. I can smell the chocolate malt too. It smells pretty good. Smell a lot of very sweet smelling. So, see what it tastes like. See if there's any maple syrup in this. What do you think? Cheers, guys. <clears throat> A lot of maple syrup in that. This is sweet beer. Wow. I like it. It's different. I've not, I've not had a beer that's, got, that's had that much maple syrup in it before. It'd be like a chick beer here. Low ABV. Pretty sweet. I don't know if I could drink more than about two of these, but that's tasty. I like that. It's something different. Uh, a lot of roasted malt, chocolate, not so much coffee there. Maybe just a slight tinge. The maple syrup is what comes out on this beer. But it's good. I mean, it's really good. 4.50 ABV. You can have a couple of them and not worry about it, so. It's right out of the fridge. We're going to let it warm up. See if it changes any. So stick around. I'll be right back and we'll see what, what, it, what the final chug is going to bring on this one, guys. All right, guys. Thanks for sticking around. Got just a little bit left in the glass here. It's uh, Don't think I could drink very many of these. It's awful sweet now that it's warmed up. And got room temperature. Hmm. Very sweet. A lot of maple syrup in that. So it's, a, it's an okay beer. Like I said, I don't think I could drink very many of them. It's uh, pretty sweet. Final chug. It's a nice novelty beer, in my opinion, though. It's like a pumpkin beer, you know. It's nice to have that when the season rolls around and have a couple of them, but 
wouldn't want to drink those kind of beers all the time either. So, that being said, uh, if you've had that beer, let me know. Uh, I think it's okay though. I mean, it's like eggnog. You only want it once it, <laughs> you ever want it every now and again at Christmas time or whatever. So, uh, Ray Beer has this at 33 overall and 21 in the style. So, nobody on that side of the fence sounds like they were liking it. And Beer Advocate has a B minus on that. So, I. I, I kind of agree with that. I was going to give it a C, but it's a B minus. So I'm going to give it a five. So it's a it's a five on the scale. It's a it's a decent beer. It's it's got a lot of got a lot of toffee caramel and a little bit of a uh, chocolate going on there. Uh, a little nuttiness, but uh, I'm not getting much coffee in this. So uh, uh, let me know what you think, guys. If you've had it, if not you've seen it, pick it up, give it a try. You might like it. Uh, what I call a Kick beer. So <laughs> that being said, guys, rate, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you tomorrow in the next beer review. Cheers.